So my 10 and seven year old uh, were that age when we took them to Disney for the first time. And uh, we took them to Disney and SeaWorld for seven days. And I refer to these seven days like it were the seven days I spent in Vietnam. <laughs> I did seven days in the Orlando sun with Walt and Savannah and my wife, Ashley, and I still have flashbacks. <laughs> we stayed at Animal Kingdom Lodge because I didn't want to ever have a savings account. <laughs> and I heard probably a thousand times from my little 10 year old and seven year old, so much garbage that I said, a million times, whoa, Savannah, there are other people staying in this hotel that don't want to hear all that from you. And they're like, but the ice cubes are shaped like Goofy and the, and the chocolate is shaped like Mickey and there's elephants that run through in the morning. I'm like, whoa, Savannah, there are other people staying in this hotel that don't want to hear all that from you. And my 10 year old Savannah's like, dad, I don't think they can hear us through the hall. <laughs> Your father is right. <laughs> there are other people staying in this hotel that don't want to hear all that from you. <laughs> so my 10 year old Savannah is awesome. I love her. She's great. I wouldn't change a hair on her head, but she is a little daredevil and she will ride anything. And uh, I rode nothing as a child and I ride nothing as an adult, <laughs> mostly because I'm terrified of heights. And she was watching videos of every roller coaster and found the Manta roller coaster at SeaWorld. And she decided she was gonna ride it. And I found videos of kids getting off the ride crying. And I was showing her those videos. <laughs> and she watched the first one of this like 13 year old kid getting off of it having a panic attack crying. And she's like, let's go. <laughs> so we're in line at the Manta and I'm like, Savannah, I wanna let you know that daddy didn't really ride rides like this when I was a kid, nor do I ride them now, but I'm gonna ride it with you. But you might hear me scream a really bad swear word. <laughs> and I need you to not tell mom. <laughs> and she's like, it's all right, dad. We learned them all from the neighbors. <laughs> so you gotta understand. You're on the Manta roller coaster, right? You sit under it, you're under the track. You sit in it like a ski lift. So your feet are dangling. And then right as you embark out on the journey, this is what happens. Click. So now you're not lying under the track like a ski lift. You're on under the track like this. And it looks like it might have been uncomfortable. And it was. <laughs> they say in the advertising, you feel like you're flying like Superman, but no. Not at all. It's really more like you're stapled to the back of a bat. <laughs> flying straight into Hades. And then I'd go out on it and go up the clickety-clack, 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 and I'm terrified of heights, so all I ever hear in the clickety-clack is like, you're gonna die, you're gonna die, you're gonna die. So I shut my eyes and I go all the way to the top with my eyes shut, and on a normal roller coaster, when you get to the crest of the hill, you open your eyes and you see all of God's creation. You see the horizon, you see the sun setting, you see the clouds, you see your daughter, and you're like, this is awesome, yay. But on the Manta roller coaster, you're under the track. So when you open your eyes, you're looking down into the parking lot <laughs> where your head will be bludgeoned when you fall. So you swoop down the roller coaster like this, facing this way and go up and into an inverted loop lying on your back, which is horribly confusing. And I thought we had flown off the track and we're spinning off into the parking lot. So I'm just like, oh, Slayer. Savannah is next to me like this. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, she is having a good time. <laughs> and my life went into slow motion. I read this ride is 90 seconds. Surely I can survive 90 seconds. Only 89 more seconds. <sighs> so I only need one thing to do in this moment and was only equipped to do one thing in this moment, so I did it. Our Father, <laughs> who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. 
Forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Unless it's trespasses, Lord, I've never quite got the hang of that one. Oh, we're done. We're done. Savannah, that wasn't even that. We're done. That's not awesome. Not done! Oh! How do they do that in gravity? This is different technology. I don't understand. I look and Savannah's like, yay! <laughs> and I'm like, yay! No, I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. <laughs> I will fear no evil. It's surely goodness and love. We'll dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Oh, we're done. We're done. We're done. Oh, oh. Savannah jumps off the ride and is like, let's do it again. <laughs> no. <laughs> you are an abomination. <laughs> so we get off the ride. We get back to the hotel, to the Animal Kingdom Lodge. And we're sleeping boy girl, because my 10-year-old girl won't sleep with my seven-year-old boy. And I'm like, why won't you sleep with Walt, Savannah? And she said, Dad, he's just always moist. <laughs> that even mean? <laughs> and she said, you'll see. <laughs> so I'm in bed with Walt, wrapped around trying to not touch him, keeping like an eight inch buffer, and steam is rising from his head. <laughs> It's like, you know, when you're on the concrete and it's hot and you can't see through it, because it's like, I couldn't even see my wife from the, uh, Somewhere in the middle of the night, about 5.45 in the morning, the trumpeting sound of flatulence enters <laughs> the hotel. 60% of you were like, oh, that's disgusting. And 30% of you were like, no, 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 that's hilarious. <laughs> and 10% of you were like, what's flatulence? I... <laughs> but it jolts Walt out of bed like reveille out of a bugle in the Marine Corps, just like, bah, 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 bah! and he flips over a few times and lands on his feet like a cat. And he's like, Dad, there are other people <laughs> staying in this hotel. <laughs> Your boy is right. There are other people. Oh, you guys are great. 